It's Monday, so that means our fitness fairy, Miss Julie Leaf of Fit Organics, is in studio today. Miss Jules, here's the reality of the situation. We are now a month in of our New Year's resolution. Some people have been pounding the pavement hard and working their asses off. Yep. But I think it's time now, at a month in, yep. you got to change it up. You know what? You're absolutely right. It's it's everybody's starting to get a little bit bored of what they were really super excited to do before January. Right. And it's really important to make sure that you're changing up your workout routine. So, you know, I joined the cult of yoga. Yes. And I did that for hardcore for a bit. I did that with you, too. Yes. And mm-hmm. now I've decided to change things up. And now I'm a pro boxer. So you went from bringing peace and shanti <laughs> and love and stretchiness to yeah. now you're bringing punches in the face and I bite hard ears abs off. and you're biting. Yes, I bite biting people's ears, ears off. off. That's I like the dichotomy that is you. I, I got to I really, this, I really do. This Saturday, I yeah. went to um, my first boxing class. Cool. And I got to tell you, it's exhilarating. Really? Eh? Oh. Did, did you have to get punched? I'm going to go with you. Yes. Uh, I, I've Saturday. committed to going with you, but I don't want to get punched. No, no, no. Am no. I going to get punched? Nobody gets no, punched. No one gets punched. Okay. You punch. Oh, you punch oh, stuff. Yeah. You punch. So, Ooh, so I'm glad. That's so, so butch. It, thank you very much. Mm-hmm. I am a dude, you know. Oh, I know that. Yeah. There's no question in my yeah. mind. Yeah, yeah. So, okay. So now the reality is it was good that I changed things up. Absolutely. And so, you know, when you're looking at... um how your body works and how our body works with repetition that has its uh, merits, but it also has its stopping point. So, after a while, your body will get used to a certain range of motion. It will get used to a certain workout. It will get used to a certain routine. And so in order to keep um, your muscles challenged and to keep your body growing and your body fat levels lowering and all that good stuff, your fitness level improving, you've got to make sure that you change out your workout routine or change up your workout routine. And it doesn't... It doesn't necessarily mean that you'll never go back to those activities you were doing. It can mean that you can even add something complementary too. So, for instance, yoga and boxing would go well together because yoga is about calming and, um, you know, a lot of stretching and a lot of breathing, whereas boxing is about breathing, but you're not conscious of it. You have to breathe no matter what, but boxing is about flexing and a stance and where your body pos- body's position is and, and so on. Now, I don't know a lot about boxing, but the way that it works your body is completely different than the way yoga works your body. So again, those two things would be complementary. You might not want to do, say, obstacle courses and boxing um, right at once because, of course, those two things have a lot in common. Very high intensity. Remember that every workout works your adrenal glands too. So if it's something that's very revving, you want to make sure that you're trying to balance it with something a little bit, a little bit calming too. It's time to change up your workout. Don't get bored. Change things up. Julie Leaf, Fit Organics. Check out her website. Her diets, her approach to fitness and health is something that you should definitely be inspired by. I love her sexy guts. She has helped me drop 20 pounds over the course of a year, which I'm mm-hmm. very happy about. We'll be right back more with Julie Leaf from Fit Organics. Check her out online at www.fitorganicswithanx.com. We'll be right back. They're sassy, they're called the Scissor Sisters, and they don't feel like dancing on the Pride of Toronto, 1039 Pride FM. And if you're just joining us on the Shalou Show, it is Mind and Body Monday, and we're talking to our fitness fairy, Julie Leaf. And the reality is we are a month into our New Year's resolutions, and there is a time and a place where you need to change your workouts up. So, Julie, what are the four reasons or the ways you know you got to change it up? All right. So, first and foremost, as is true with you and I especially and all the other ADHD types out there, when your workout bores you. When your workout wah, wah, wah. Exactly. When your workout bores you, you're so much less likely to do it. Yeah. And you're so much likely more likely to do it and um not pay attention and injure yourself. So if it's su- getting super boring and you want to die when you think about working out, then it's time to change it up. Okay. Boredom yeah. out. Boredom out, big time. Um, Even if that cute guy that you check out at the bar, at the bar, at the at the gym, at the bar, even now. the cute guy that you check out at the gym, <laughs> yeah. if, if he's not even cute anymore, oh, you know boy. you're bored. That's yeah, that's you know the end bored. of the road. Yeah, yeah time to move on. Yeah. Um, number two, if it's not giving you results anymore. Right. Right. If you're if you're doing the same thing and your body's just kind of staying the same and you're not really seeing much happen. Yeah. Time to go. Um, 
also if um, it's no longer challenging. Not only is it no longer giving you results, but it's just not difficult to do. You're not getting sore after and you, know, you don't feel like you did anything after. That's time to go. I have to say, changing yeah. up from yoga to boxing, I have been <laughs> in a... Um, Massive. I ate a bottle of Advil on Saturday after my (laughs) class and I washed it down with three bottles of wine. Right. (laughs) Maybe not the best after workout technique. I don't know if that's, yeah, that's not quite normal. But I'm still feeling the pain from the boxing today and it's Monday. Wow. Yeah, that's that's that was that's a good, good change. That's good. That's definitely a good change. But maybe step away from the three bottles of wine and the bottle of Advil. Yeah, that's not a good combo. No, no, I think it's the, um, what do we call those uh, calories? We call them empty, uh, calories? empty no. calories. Maybe the empty <laughs> calories after the boxing with the three bottles of wine and the Advil is not good. No, you'd be less sore, I think, if you did some like greens plus and ate your fit organic. Oh, right. Okay, good. Right. Good but that know. doesn't come on Saturday, so you're right. forgiven. You're right, forgiven. right, right. Okay, Friday. I mean, I mean, Friday. Last. 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 <laughs> Number four. <laughs> Number four. Um, and this is interesting. If your workout leaves you much more sore and less energized than normal or than it used to. You, when you're done your workout, you want to feel energized. You yep. definitely want to feel sore, but you know, we're talking good sore. When your workout is leaving you feeling bad sore, as in like, you're, Ouch. Or, yeah, you're a runner and your knees really hurt yeah, no, no, or, no. you know, your hips are really bugging you after that long yoga class of way too much. Yep. I don't know what pose. Then you probably, it's time to move and change and do a different workout so that different muscles are hurting and and again you feel excited about it and excited to go back to it food for thought with fit organics check julie leaf our fitness fairy out online she is smart she is delicious and she cares about you her website is www.fitorganics.com and you can also check us out on twitter and don't forget facebook lots of new photos and if you like cookies like i do and you want to have guilt-free cookies her cookie dough is in so many grocery stores across the city. It's called Fit Organics. Yeah. It is delicious. There's it's four flavors. Three flavors. Okay. Uh, oatmeal, raisin, chocolate chip, and double chocolate chunk. You've had the fourth flavor that's not quite out uh, yet. Oh, okay. That's why you're thinking for. And All right. uh, yeah, we're at Whole Foods Noah's, Lady York Foods. And uh, 